folks. Alexis Wainwright to take you inside the hospital for a moment that filled quite a few hearts. After more than 47 years. The Dallas family is meeting their hero, now retired Captain Harold Minter. People need to hear that they made an impact in somebody's life. And I wanted him to know that from me. There's not even really an emotion to describe. It was so many by only one. It was so, it was happy. I was happy. Um, I was overwhelmed. Um, I felt honored that I was, you know, his daughter, and how cool is that? You know that that it all came full circle. A December night in Dallas, 1974. That's when Dallas Fire Captain Mentor and Fire Rescue Officer Jimmy Hendricks ran into a burning home and saved the lives of two young children in Dallas. Because of what he's done, it's allowed us to live our lives and has allowed us, my mother to be 100% who she is because she still has all her three kids at that moment. Antonio Garcia can remember the exact moment they came running out with his brother and sister who were found unconscious. Through their cries uh, and yelling, they found where they were, reached in, uh, got them out of the house. Both firemen were awarded the Medal of Valor, but after hearing the story firsthand from her father, Suzanne Minter had more questions. I just always wondered in my mind, what and did they survive? Are they okay? And all these years later, the power of social media brought closure to Captain Minter and the Garcias in a day they'll never forget. I wanted him to hear it from us. My mom went over there, my dad went over there, my brother, uh, my sister. Finally, thanking their hero face to face. And the fact that you saved me makes that possible for me to be there for that family. Oh, no. I've never seen him smile so so deep. It's great. It's a beautiful relationship, and it's it's um it's something I never dreamed. In Dallas, Alexis Wainwright, CBS 11 News. Told your hearts would be full. The Garcias did want to, of course, try and connect with rescue officer Jimmy Hendricks. He did, unfortunately, pass away earlier this year, but they're saying they still hope to maybe have a chance to thank his family. And something tells me, Nicole,